Public servants from the Goilala District and Central Province have been urged to return to Tapini and Waitape respectively and carry out their mandated duties instead of staying in Port Mosby and getting paid for doing nothing. Outgoing Chief Executive of the Goilala District Development Authority, Francis Javia, issued a call recently in Port Mosby during the launch of the Goilala District Impact Projects. The call comes as Gualala District is embarking on major impact infrastructure and other projects worth over a million kina. Mr. Javier says his administration has made available houses for public servants to be accommodated in the district, so there should be no excuse. Jehabakia reports. It was revealed during the launching of impact projects in Guelala that many public servants who are supposed to be serving in the districts are not doing so, but have been getting paid whilst residing in the nation's capital. The DDA CEO said under his leadership they have made accommodations available in Tapini and Waitape stations, and there should not be any more excuses from public servants. He pointed out that public servants have become entangled in intentions that are not beneficial to the district, and it is time to change this trend. I paid all illegal occupants. We secured nine houses. The houses are ready. It's a message that you said public servants stop, get back up there. Honorable member has noble intentions. Let us all stand and let us all support him. Is a man who can deliver. Classical example, explicit, explicit example is right here. Local MP William Sam made it clear that under his leadership, a wind of change was blowing for Guelala, and he urged all his people to join this change. He said past differences must be put aside, and the development of the district put in the forefront, so everyone may work in collaboration to achieve change, and a better outcome for services delivered. Mr. Sam also supported the call made by his district CEO. Three bedroom, five, uh, two bedroom, free KK, water supply, water, free stall tapping. Why are we paying for these things here? Please, provincial administration, please help us uh, progressively vacate to uh, uh, Tapini. First vehicle, I demand all first you guys get the vehicle in Tapini New Year. See us, staff. Tabini. Ogata LLG staff Tabini. Public servants were given three months to move back to the district or have their employment contracts terminated. Jehab Akia, NBC National News, Port Mosby.